Hi, Bill Gilliland here. I'd like to I'd like to invite you out to the to the last free multi-million dollar business building intensive that I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to keep doing the multi-million dollar business building intensive. So if you can't make it to this one, it's okay. I'm just going to have to charge for it. What's happened is uh, my the feedback I've gotten from the people that came to it said, Bill, you know, you need to be charging for this. It's, it actually it's a full day full-on content based eight hours of content uh, on how to build any business so who it's for is business owners who have employees or who are looking to, to, to have employees who want to build a business that someday could be sold or could be passed on to heirs whatever so we're gonna I'm gonna go through step by step now we cover basically three areas one is money okay which is getting more cash flow in your business and also getting more profit in your business time how to get more time back in your life for family friends and those kind those kind of things hobbies whatever and then thirdly how to build a team that can run the business for you so that your business actually looks like an investment and can be sold at some point or passed on to heirs at a reasonable price so those are the three areas we're going to cover one of the questions i always get is hey bill is this going to be one of those deals where I come in and go to a free seminar and I'm going to be sold all day long? Well, no, that's not the case at all. Uh, what we're going to do, we're going to provide eight hours flat out content. We're going to cover the six steps to grow any business. And so that's, uh, and you say, okay, what is the catch? Well, there's two catches. One is I need your honest feedback on how we can make the program better. So I'm going to allow that or I'm going to ask for your feedback on that. The second thing that I know is that some of you who attend the multi-million dollar business builders intensive will be inspired to do something more with that or at the worst case will refer other people to come to it. That's been our experience. So but just to give you some idea of the kind of things we're going to cover I'm going to give you a, a, a one concept that we're going to cover for from the money section of building your business and what i find with most business owners is is that, that that i work with is we don't actually know our numbers so one of the numbers or one of the key numbers we need to know is how much do we actually need to sell to break even so i'm going to give you the simple formula to figure out in your business what break even is and you know and you can back into the number of of widgets or hours or whatever you need to provide to break even. So the formula is very simple. It's break even, so BE stands for break even, equals our fixed cost, our fixed cost divided by one minus our variable cost. So fixed cost divided by one minus our variable cost. Now the fixed cost are done in terms of dollars. And variable costs are done as a percentage of sales. So because a fixed cost by definition is a cost that will go on regardless of whether we sell any items or any hours or any of our time or whatever, depending on what you do. The variable cost, however, is if as we sell one item, there is a cost. It might be materials. It might be hours of labor. It might be commissions that will vary in, in run. So real quickly, if your fixed costs are $100,000 and your variable costs are, let's say, uh, 20%, so then you would have $100,000 divided by 0 .8, 0 0.8, and that would give, and let's do a quick calculation here. I haven't done this in advance, so we take 100,000 and we divided it by 0.8. That means that our, our break even is actually going to be $125,000. Now, for those of you who are quick at math, if, if you have an item that say an average dollar sale of, a, of let's say $1,000, then you're going to have to sell 125 just to break even. If you're going to sell, if you have an average dollar sale of 500, you're going to have to sell 250 of those items to break even. 
So this gives you a way to tell at what point of the day you might break even or what point of the month you might break even. Or if you buy a truck and it's going to cost you $30,000, then how much do we need to sell to actually break even on the truck? So I hope this helps. I hope this gives you some kind of idea of the kind of in-depth things that we're really going to dig into during the multi-million dollar business intensive. I hope that you'll be there. I look forward to seeing you there. We're going to have a great day. It's August 1st. It's a Friday. Just go ahead and mark your calendar off. Come on and attend. It's going to be, I'm only limiting it to 30 people. So I've already got 17 signed up. So get, I, want, I hope that you'll be one of those 13 who can fill up the last, the last seats. I look forward to seeing you there.